Hi everybody, this is Sona. Um, I am um, going on here today because tomorrow I am not going to be able to do a live. I might pre-record a video and post it. Um, and I might post it early because I will be stuck under a MRI machine. And I titled this live, uh, you may know my name and not my story, um, because as of lately, I'm, I'm being judged by actions I make and, um, or I'm being judged by the way I look or I'm being judged by how I'm saying things and you know my thing is you may know my name but you don't know me so why judge someone based on what you think they're doing wrong or or by the way they look or how they present things um I believe everybody is different in how they present certain things you know a personality you know why judge somebody's personality um, and it's it's just a oh, really you know funny how how people do that and you know get to know the real person have a real conversation with them not just and I'm, I'm saying this because this is happening a lot to me on social media and you know I don't know you I have no right to judge you frankly only only person that needs to judge is the universe that's the ultimate judge that's who I need to answer to so that is you know why I'm, I'm saying this because you know what I, I don't judge you know I you know I, I, I'm a very opinionated and I'm very inquisitive um some people may not like that but at the same token I'm not gonna judge you because you have an expectation of me and I'm not not living up to it but I'm, I'm sorry you know I don't know you I don't know you I have not had interaction with you personally so who gives you the right to judge um now this is when I do judge and I may offend some people when I say this I've had a series of online um, breakthrough call requests and people either don't show up or they um, they cancel, which is totally fine. Now, when you don't show up, oh, that's when my judgment comes in because you know what? You wasted my time. My time is valuable. I put my time out there for you to give you my time at not a cost and then you waste it. Now, hell yeah, I'm going to judge you on that. But if I haven't had any interaction with you, if I hadn't had a vocal, I like to say vocal conversation, not messaging, not text, a vocal over the phone over Facebook call hi Sean I don't know you I, I'm sorry so before someone judges me take the time and initiative to get to know who I am get to know my story get to know my personality because you will probably be fooled so I just wanted to definitely um, put that out there. Hi, Sean. Um, I, I wanted to definitely put that out there because you know what? At the end of the day, 
I look out for myself. I expect everybody else to look out for their best interests. I've been preaching this all week because, you know, learn from my mistakes, especially for my health. Now, my doctors has added another freaking pill. I am, I'm on so much medication right now. I can't even keep up. So now I need a nutrition and health overhaul. I can't really exercise. Only thing I could probably do is exercise in the pool, which I'm going to start doing that. And, um, but I, I'm, I'm calling to all the really nutrition coaches out there. You know, if you could help a girl get her nutrition back on track, um, that would be great. Um, there's a problem also, you know, I love to cook, love to cook, but I can start cutting vegetables and my wrists start hurting. So I have to watch prepare foods. I got to cut out fast food. So that means no more Popeye's chicken sandwiches. <laughs> um, I I can't, I can't eat any more fast food, y'all. No more French fries. She told me I couldn't even eat potato chips. I was like, this is some bullshit. I'm like, uh-uh. I, I was like, look, I'll eat two chips a day if I have to. But yeah, I have to totally, um, completely. And I don't eat that much salt as it is. I have to eliminate salt completely. I, so I ended up buying a salt substitute. So I, I really have to watch my sodium now. Um, I'm on, I'm on like now they have me on two types of blood pressure medicine. It's it's bad. One of them helps. Um, man, because my heart is really on overdrive right now, um, due to the pain and the stress my body is going through. And, and so, yeah, yeah, ouch, you could say that again. So this really, this slip and fall that I've experienced has really, it's really taken a toll on my body and um, I was told I supposed to been I had supposed to been working with my the injuries that I'm suffering through. I supposed to been like off recovering, and um, you know, hi heat though. Uh, I supposed to been like totally like in recovery. It's it's like now my body is trying to really trying to overcompensate for things that um. That's getting out of whack because I'm dealing with so much pain and I'm dealing with it for so long. And the pain is nerve pain. So it's, it's, it's crazy. And the funny thing is, you know, they denied me treatment and they've, um, they've done a lot of stuff, but getting back to you guys, cause it's all about you all, you know, I really, I, I, I can't stress this enough. You you have to look out for your best interest in business and personal life. Put yourself first. You come first in all things. Don't put a business first. Don't put your family first. Put yourself first. Because when you're on that airplane, what do they say? Put your oxygen mask on first before you help someone else. So make sure you're okay before you help anybody else. Because you um you can't give when your 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 cup is empty. You you can't. And you know I knew this. But I was putting everybody first but myself and look where I'm at. But that shit's about the motherfucking change because you know what? 
Sona's about to come back with a fucking vengeance. And, you know, I I just, I, I really just want people to learn from the mistakes I've made. Like I was saying yesterday, you know, I really had an epiphany that the job that I had, and I'm putting it in past tense, had, because I've made up my in my mind that I'm not going back, try to kill me. They try to fucking kill me. So, um, I gotta look out for me. I gotta look out for my business. I gotta get my business up and running and running strong. And, um, you know, yeah. Um, I, I, I gotta make that comeback. And I gotta come hard. They say go hard or go home. Um, I got a lot of shit to prove to myself. And you know what? There's there's a lot of people watching me. They may not say anything. You see my mess, my this is my son's mess over here. <laughs> um you know, I'm go hard or go home. And um and that's it. Cuz it's time for me to live. I haven't lived in a long time. And you should enjoy life. So everybody put that as number 1. Enjoy your life. Because if you're not enjoying your life, what's the reason to live? So, I'm going to sign out from here. I'm doing this live because I won't be on tomorrow. And um, I'll see you soon. Bye.